Bella a tutti ragazzi e benvenuti in questo nuovo video e siamo tornati su The Walking Dead Gioca E dai, ok E mi scuso se um, non vi ho salutato e, um, e cominciamo da qua Sì sì lo sappiamo già Shaboom! Eh già, è la vita. Damn, what they get this time? Uh, looks like a rat. Che c'era fame. <sighs> well, that's another meal lost. Eh già, già. I still can't believe we went through all that commissary food in three months. It seemed like so much at the time. Maybe you shouldn't have opened the door. Yeah, except then I'd probably be food by now. Trust me, I have no regrets. Uh, rabbit's hardly a meal, Mark, but I'd take it. We're all hungry. No kidding. When I accidentally grabbed for Carly's rations the other night, I thought she was going to take off my hand. We're all on edge. Just cut us some slack. Yeah, you're right. I wish I knew for sure how much food we have left. Uh, non, non basta. Not enough. According to Lily, we've just about hit the last of our food reserves. Some people might have to go without tonight. You mean Lily's lottery again? Ken is gonna be pissed. She thinks everyone should have an equal chance of missing a meal. Yeah. You think Kenny's having any more luck than we are out here? I sure hope so. Okay. Yeah, between the lack of food and Kenny and Lily fighting all the time. Things are getting pretty tense back at the motor inn. You know, Kenny's been talking about taking off if he can get that RV running. Chi non ci abbandonerà? He's a good man. Yeah, I guess we'll see. Can't blame him though. Did you hear Larry going off on him last night? What's the old guy's deal anyway? Seems like he's got a problem with you in particular. Looking out for his daughter. Hey, I know Lily. She can take care of herself. He needs to take that energy and put it towards finding us some more food. And I know Lily thinks he's getting weaker, but the guy's all muscle. He's a walking pile driver. I know I wouldn't want to be stuck in a room with him. And didn't he punch you in the face one time? Uh, knock me flat. Non rischiare di sparare. Non vale la pena. Yeah, I really freaking hungry. che fa però. Ecco. E se sono cazzi. Come on. Come on. Eh già. Non si mette male. Dai, dai, corri, corri, corri. Jesus Christ. Oh shit, no, no, please don't kill us. We just want to help our teacher. We'll leave, I swear. Lee, you guys okay? Get, get it off. Get it off, God damn it! Get, get it off me! Travis, maybe they can help! These might be the same guys that raided our camp and we barely got away from that. What guys? Why the fuck is there a trap out male. here? It's okay. We're not gonna hurt you. Don't listen to them, Ben. Please, just let us go. We're not a threat to you. Kid, chill out. We'll try to help you, but you gotta shut the fuck up. 
believe this is fucked up. You gotta help. Please. Ben, shut up. My dad was special forces. I know what I'm doing. Just see if you can get him out. After that, you can leave us or whatever. I don't care. Please. This isn't our problem. We should go. No, no, please! At least just look at the trap! Just look at it, and maybe you can tell us how to get it off! Please help me! Hurry, please, hurry! Lee, this trap's been altered. There's no release latch. Hey, Chuck. Oh no. Arrivano i zombie. Please, get me out of this. Mark, get the boys back. Kenny, keep those walkers away. Allora. Ah, you senti. Ti taglio direttamente la gamba, è l'unica soluzione. No, no, no. Try the trap again. Anything, please. Try to get the chain. Mi dispiace. Mi spiace, ma lo devo fare. Eh, L'ho liberato. The Walking Dead Capitolo 2 Hotel T Trivago Prenota No scherzo Open. We've got wounded. Shit. What the hell are they doing? Yes, in cats. Oh, come on. Oh, God. What happened? Oh, oh, what the hell? We don't have time to explain. Lee, are you okay? Get him into the truck. I'll see what I can do. Cat, okay? can you fix him? Jesus, Ken. Lee. I, I don't know. Lee. What the hell? You can't just be bringing new people here. What are you thinking? Hey, you want to calm down for a fucking hey, minute? What? No, come I on. don't. I want to know why you thought bringing more mouths to feed was a good idea. I thought we could save his life. I'm the one that took his leg. That makes me responsible. Well, that was a stupid thing to do. We are not responsible for every struggling survivor we come across. We have to focus on our group, right here, right now. Well, hang on. We haven't even talked to these people yet. Maybe they can be helpful. Come on, Lily. These are people. People trying to survive just like us. We've got to stick together to survive. The only reason you're here is because you had food. Enough for all of us. But that food is almost gone. We've got maybe a week's worth left. And I don't suppose you guys are carrying any groceries, are you? 
Um, no. Fine, you guys fight it out then. Welcome to the family, kid. Come over here and see what I drew. But, what? No, I... Just come on, okay? You know, you like to think you're the leader of this little group, but we can make our own goddamn decisions. This is your own personal dictatorship. Oh, come on, you're being dramatic. It died. Everything yeah. always turns into a power struggle between you two. I'm not going to be a part of that. Hey, I didn't ask to lead this group. Everyone was happy to have me distributing the food when there was enough to go around. Report to Kikolod. Suddenly, I'm a goddamn Nazi. It doesn't matter who's in charge. Most people are here now. I guess we just have to decide what happens no, next. No, Lee, it does matter. One person can't be in charge of everything. You know, it might feel safe for you to sit on the fence, but sooner or later you're going to have to decide whose side you're on. I don't see any of you stepping up to make the hard decisions. My girl's got more balls than all of you combined. Dad, please. Why don't you go help Mark with the wall? Ecco, diglielo, fatti cazzi tuoi. Bravo, vattene. You think this is easy for me? Everyone's starting to hate me because I'm the one that rations the food. But nobody else wants to. You know what? I'm not doing it tonight. You do it. There's today's food rations, but there's not enough for everyone. Good luck. You stay calm, eh? I think so too. Ho solo quattro porzioni per dieci persone. Allora. Devo scegliere. Allora, <coughs> vediamo un po'. Lei perché mi è stata affidabile. How you doing, Clementine? Okay. Where's your hat? I don't know. Can you help me find it? Non ho tempo. Sorry, honey, I don't have time. That was my favorite hat. I promise. If I find it, I'll let you know. Thank you. Okay, Clem. I've got to take care of some things. Why don't you go back to playing with Duck for a while? Okay. Allora. Want something to eat? Pizza can in secata. Take this. How about my boy? He eat yet? Uh, no. Come talk to me once my boy is taken care of. Okay, allora devo dare il primo. Allora, lei cosa? Want something to eat? Pezzo di mela. God, I used to eat an apple every morning with some granola and six almonds, and that wasn't enough even then. But you know what? Yes. Allora io chiamo sto bambino. Hey Doc, how about a little food? Crecchia che il formaggio. Yeah! Oh man, I'm so hungry! E poi a lui, dai. Want something to eat? If your camp got raided, probably means you haven't eaten in a while. I am really hungry. <coughs> Thanks. Well, some of these people have gone longer than me without food. They're the ones that need it. Hello, Tiam. Will you hold the damn board steady? I'm trying. I, I didn't realize I was getting this weak already. What do you want? A handout? Uh, I got 60 cents in my pocket. If you'll shut up and quit being such a pansy. He's a manchare. Here, eat something. Thanks, Lee. Need any help with the wall? Nope. 
Actually, we could use your axe. Do you mind if we take it? Yeah, give us that thing for a bit. Uh... Mark. Here, Mark, this should help. Thanks. Hey, I'm the one doing all the work over here. You didn't think to give me the axe? Sì, sì, proprio. Sto facendo tutto il lavoro lui. Rompe i coglioni e basta. He told me so. Just like he's trying to protect Clemens out. He... I just need some food. Ma muore, non rompere i coglioni. Non rompere i coglioni. Non rompere i coglioni. Not such an easy job, is it? I hope I get to eat next time. I don't envy you. I don't know how you have the strength to do this every day. I don't have a choice. Lee, Kenny, I know I ran out of food before. Hey, you took care of my boy. As far as I'm concerned, you did right by me. Thanks, Kenny. Still. I guess some people aren't going to be happy with your choices. You're out! What happened to my food? There's none left. You keep treating people like this, and your days in this group are numbered. You're one to talk, old man. Yeah, well, I don't see you working on that wall. Ecco, vattene, ma che meglio. Ken, Lee, come here, please. He didn't make it, did he? He lost too much blood. God damn it. I'm getting sick of this shit. Ken, come back. There's nothing... What's his problem? Don't be like that, Lee. I know we've all seen death, but that doesn't make it any easier. That man you brought, I tried. But he was never going to survive. Well, at least he's not our problem anymore. What about the other kid? Oh, 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 ho preso la tipa. Merda. Merda, vaffanculo, mi sono sporco di cazzo, vai. B. No, oh, si è pure buggato, aia. Vai così, vai così. Oh, che cazzo è? Porco di cazzo. Eccolo. Ah. Ah. culo, mica mi è venuto il crampo al pollice, porca troia. Dad, calm down. You're gonna get us all killed! Why didn't you tell us he was bitten? What? He was bitten, and you didn't say a goddamn word! But he wasn't bitten, I swear! Well, your not-bitten friend here came back to life and tried to kill my wife! What? Wait, you all don't know? What the hell are you talking about? It's not the bite that does it. You come back no matter how you die. If you don't destroy the brain, that's just what happens. It's gonna happen to all of us. God help us. It makes sense. In those first few days, it spread so fast. Car accidents, suicides, everything was making more of them. When I first saw it happen, we were all hiding out in a gym and everybody thought we were finally safe. But one of the girls, Jenny Pitcher, I think, I guess she couldn't take it. She took some pills. A lot of them. Someone went in the girls' room the next morning and... God. Back off! Whoa, lady, relax. 
Me and my brother, we we just want to know if y'all can help us out. I said back off, Carly. Are you armed? Yeah, F for protection. Dead could be anywhere. But uh, I think you got the upper hand here. Why do you need gas? Our place is protected by an electric fence. Generators provide the electricity. Our generators run on gas. Look, we own a dairy farm a few miles up the road. If y'all be willing to lower your guns, we, we can talk about some kind of trade. How y'all doing on food? We got plenty at the dairy. Lee, why don't you and Mark check the place out? See if it's legit. I'm going with you. I got your back if anything seems fishy. So, uh, what do y'all think? You've got a deal. We'll bring some gas to your dairy. In exchange, you give us some food to bring back. We'll see how it goes from there. Sounds fair. A couple gallons should power one of our generators for a while. So, this dairy, you guys really have food? Sure do. We lost most of the cattle, but we still have lots of milk, butter, and cheese stocked up. <laughs> and with the vegetables we grow, we got plenty of food. It's nice to get away from that motel for a while. This Lily Kenny thing is starting to get ridiculous. Personally, I'd be happier if you started to take charge more. Mm. Sure, everybody looks up to you. Well, not everyone thinks I'm so trustworthy. Because of your past. Does anyone else know? Uh, You've got to let go of that guilt. The Lee I know is a good man. Clementine might know. She was there when we were talking in the drugstore and asked me about it. I lied to her, but... What exactly did happen with the senator? Uh, what I only know what the press was told. I don't know your story. Sometimes I wonder if I should talk to the group about it. You don't have to. Whatever happened before things went to hell doesn't matter anymore. Not sure everyone would see it that way. Maybe you're right. Listen, over the years I've reported on some pretty messed up shit. I've seen situations like yours a hundred times. It doesn't have to make you a bad man. I, uh, really appreciate that. I mean, thank God Lee showed up when he did. Right, Lee? Yeah, why don't you tell us a little more about yourself, Lee? Where are you from? Oh, that's too cause I'm your more. Motor ends my home now, I guess. Hmm. Well, that place seen better days, huh? You can say that again. Y'all seem pretty settled in at that motor inn. Uh, who's running things over there? And the democracy. As a group, <coughs> all of us looking out for each other. I hear that. There's so many dumbasses out there fighting each other these days. It's just stupid. How many people you got over there anyway? Quanto basta per difenderci? Well, that's good. It's getting dangerous out there. Well, you guys know. Well, we'd love to get you all out to the dairy. Like I said, we got plenty of food, and quite frankly, we could always use an extra helping hand. In the summers, I used to help out on a goat farm. Yeah, that's great. Everything helps. Mama's been running the dairy for. Well, as long as I can remember, but uh, now it's... You getting... think you're going to cut me out of this? Shit, get down. No one's trying to cut you out of anything. You and Gary are always Fucking pulling this shit. bandits. Who? Those look like the people who Calm raided down. my you're camp. Who are they? Shh. Fuck you. Fucking you knew we were hungry. They and you guys were keeping it there's up. There's only two of them. Oh, no. There's yeah, a lot you know what? more. We ate it all. What are you going to fucking do about it? Don't worry. Danny and I got you covered if something happens. Let's just wait this out. Hope they move on. Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Jesus! Asshole. The world out here has gone to shit. Come on. Let's get hey, to the where it's safe. Mondo rovinato. Ok ragazzi ci vediamo qua la prossima volta Ciao